All right, Tishan, tough win. First round here at NCAAs. Uh, you guys, first thing, every point matters for Ohio State. Yeah. I know the coaches are stressing that to you. You guys are looking for a team title. Yeah. You midseason. Didn't look like the same guy I've seen at Pitt the last two seasons, but man, you're right at the ship. You came out, you're, you got, gained some momentum at the big times. Now you're here, first round win. What's it feeling? How did you get through that midseason funk? It was, uh, feels good coming out here getting a win. You know, every point matters, like you said. Uh, everything counts. We come here to try to win a team title, so everyone got to do their part. Keep Sean fly hard. That's some motivation for me. Mike is over there getting bonus points, and that just motivates me to try to go out there and do what I can for the team. And, the midseason uh, slump ahead. I mean, yeah, it's tough going out there losing and cutting weight, and then you know you want to win for the team and everything. But these guys help a lot. The t coaches, the teammates—they're all motivating me. It's all right. Keep, keep coming back. Keep coming back. I mean, the most important thing of that was none of that makes me an All-American. So me losing and everything, knowing the fact that being here now, qualifying—that's what's most important. And none of that matters before. I mean, this is where it all counts. You see, guys, Chandler Rogers just lost first round. And I mean, anything can happen here. So it's a matter of just putting that behind us is playoff time. So it's like that wild card team that wins the Super Bowl. No one really cares about there being a wild card. So I mean, it's being here, making it happen, this is where it all counts. Leaving home, you know, you're a Pittsburgh guy. You went to Pitt, you go to Columbus. That's a totally different environment. Yeah. I mean, there were some matches. I, there were some real head scratchers this year. The Michigan State one stands out to me. Yeah. What did you learn from a lot of those? That Michigan State one was just bizarre. Let's be honest, right? Yeah, it was crazy. Because a lot of those were just like the guy was just shoving you. It was almost stalling on him. Yeah. Right? But you look at a match like that where, you know, you, you look like you're drowning out there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. What did you learn from something like that? Uh, as far as just coming from Pitt to here, I knew exactly what I was getting myself into. Tougher competition, better practice partners. So I knew what I was getting myself into. And then being here, everything's been an eye open experience and just nothing but good you take the good with the bad you know it's a roller coaster you ride the wave and uh you made the most of it so being here i wouldn't change it for the world i'll, I'll take whatever i get at the end of this day here all the results uh, i'll smile with them and know that i made a good decision it was hard leaving pit i know i'm from there and everything but i had my friends and family behind me to, to persuade me to go out there go take a journey go adventure learn and uh, that's what i did came out here like i said you take the good with the bad and these guys make it easy i'm happy with who i'm around I'm with a good support and staff and everything, and I wouldn't change it for the world. Who's next? Uh, not sure. Right now, next for me is worry about myself, get off my feet, ice bath, cold showers, just don't really prepare too much for who you got. I mean, eventually my coach will tell me who I have and what he does, but right now I just try to focus on myself, get control. You know, they say it's just as important how you finish as how you start, so making sure I prepare myself now to get ready for the next one. Good luck tonight. Thank you.